Hey YouTube, what's up? Brandon Fisher here with Fishy15 and in this video I've got an awesome review for you guys. So I've been waiting to review this product for quite some time. Finally got the nerve, just went out and got it and I've got the Hilo TC RC helicopter that you control with your iPhone, iPod Touch or even your iPad to review for you guys. So this thing looks freaking sweet, like I'm excited to review this. Um, so as I said, you can control this with your iOS device, all you need is the RC Hello TC uh, app which I just downloaded right there as you can see um, I'll get more into that in just a second but first we can take a look at the packaging so um, it's got touch control or you can tilt the device to actually steer so that is what I'm really interested in I'm really gonna see if this actually works how it works and all that good stuff so let's see there's some cool things I want to look at you've got the online directional control you have got three channels um, you have a flight record so you can save your flight plan don't know what that's all about but I'm definitely excited to check that out so it's got three steps that are really easy to follow to actually get this thing in the air so first you gotta get the app like I just showed you um, you gotta connect the controller to your device which I'll show you in just a second once we get this baby unboxed and then take off so that's that's what it says so pretty exciting here and visit helotc.com for more views or videos tips and everything else and that is basically it tells you your range this is for indoor use only flight time is approximately eight minutes charge time is 35 minutes um, compatibility tells all this iOS 4.0 or later um, iPad 2 iPad iPad touch fourth and third generation iPhone 4 um, Tells what it comes with and all that good stuff. So now we can get into the actual unboxing. All right, guys. So let's get right into this. Let's move around my workspace. Go ahead. And got my murder knife right here to unbox this thing. There's only a little sticker too. And here we go, guys. Take the rest of the packaging out of here. Go ahead and move my murder weapon over here. I don't want to hurt anybody. Uh, you get my. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> Anyways, here is the actual helicopter, guys, right inside the package. Let's go ahead and take this baby out. Go ahead and take that packaging off. Just sit it over here. I don't want to break it before I don't even get to use it. Oh, didn't even see this. So just untwist those things. Just. Pull it out here. I think there might be another one. Yep, right here. Just throw those aside and voila. This thing's actually built pretty well, as you guys can see here. It's got the Griffin logo right on the tail back here. You've got your on and off switch here and your charging port right there. So this thing looks pretty sweet, guys. I'm excited to get into this. Right down here we've got you got some extra wings it looks like and your charging port. You can charge it right with the computer. It's got a USB right in there. Um, sure we can go ahead and take a look at this too. Don't think I'll need the packaging, so just go ahead and tear right into this. Sit this stuff down right here. So, yep, here we go. We've got some extra um, rear uh, propter helicopter thing, whatever you call them on the back. I don't even know. We've got some other ones right here, the bigger ones for the actual helicopter on the top. And we've got the USB. You just plug this right into your computer and plug this right into the helicopter, and voila. So, now we can go ahead and set this stuff aside and we can get into, we can take a look at the flight manual real quick. Just tells you how to charge it and how to set it up. Here's your landing pad. That's pretty cool. You just cut it out and set it there. It tells you how to set up your little remote control. So now we can go ahead and take a look at this. And I will actually be needing my murder weapon again here. So let's dig right into here. And there we go. I'm pretty excited to actually see how this thing works too. And you guys can find this on griffintechnology.com. This thing will run you about 49, so about 50 bucks. Um, but I would definitely recommend this, even just from looking at it. So as you can see, you got some silicone feel right here, so your iPod won't slip out. We can go ahead and take my iPod out of here, 
and I'm pretty sure you just slide it right on here just like so and you're just gonna want to plug it your control right there so then you've actually got a like a remote control and it actually feels pretty nice guys so I'm really liking this and your batteries will probably go right below yep your batteries will go right in here and I'll actually take take quite a few batteries too for so well that's all right and I will get this helicopter up and ready and I'll give you some demos pretty excited about this guys first off I just want to take a look at how easy the charging is and show you guys so basically just plug the other end into the USB on your computer your laptop wall charger car anything take the charger port just plug it directly right into the helicopter itself and then I'll show you guys the blue light you can actually see the LED uh, blue light or not blue the red light right on side the blue actual USB input and that's indicating that the helicopter is actually charging so and make sure your helicopter is actually turned off there's a little off switch right there when it's charging so make sure it's off and now we can go ahead and take a look at the actual remote control I've been doing a little testing about this before I do the video just to get sure make sure I get it down make sure I make the product look good because it's kind of bad if I don't know how to use it you know but first off just download the Hilo TC helicopter remote control from the app store and it looks pretty sweet guys so first things when it pops up it'll tell you to make sure your volume is on max make sure you're turned on airplane mode and settings and that is basically it so some of the features we've got you can turn on your headlight of your helicopter just tap that and turn it off um, it's got a sweet trackpad thing right here you just basically just move it around you can trim your helicopter if it's tilting to the left a little bit just hit the left or right button and then it'll tilt it back you got your lift off you just slide that up and actually stays there unless you swipe down um you've got warnings down there you've got settings you can take a look at these settings you've got the joystick or you can have motion channel abc um invert pitch control you can throttle on right, so you can put the throttle on the right, or you can have expert mode. That's pretty cool. Um, you got the help up there, and then you got the check mark. So, and then you've got flight planes. I have not had a chance to check those out, but I will have a little demo after the actual demo of flying the helicopter around of what the flight plans are and what that does. Because I'm pretty excited. I don't really know what it is. I haven't read much about it, but it sounds pretty sweet, guys. So that's basically it. Now we can get into the demos. All right, so I give it a little quick charge, just a few minutes, and I can go ahead and just turn the switch to on. You'll see the lights start flashing up in there, indicating that it's on. You can take your device, make sure it's on airplane mode, and the volume is all the way up. You can launch the application. It'll go right to here. And when the other LEDs start flashing on your helicopter, you, that means that it's actually on. We can go, I'll show you the headlights there and the lights. You can go ahead and turn them off by just tapping that button there. Turn them back on. That's pretty cool. So I'll just keep them on here. I'm going to go put it on the stool over here. I'm not too good at this. haven't done it too many times, but I'm just going to give you a little demo here so you can... <laughs> See, I'm not the greatest, but I'll give that another shot here. Alright guys, give it a little charge here. Now I'm actually going to test out the motion controls. Set the helicopter right back there. And as you can see on my device, when you move the device, so my iPod Touch in this sense, we can actually see the joystick actually moving around. So that's going to be pretty fun. I'm going to actually see how this baby works. Go ahead and give it a shot here. So it's pretty fun guys, um, it's actually harder to do it that way than actually moving it with the joystick, but that's going to be pretty fun once I actually figure out how to use this. <laughs> Man, I don't think that's good for it, but anyways, this is really fun guys. I'm not the greatest at it, I just unboxed this as you see, as you saw like not even 10 minutes ago, I haven't even got a chance to check it out. but. Anyways, here's just the basic of the device and the little toy here. You got your remote here and the actual helicopter. So definitely check this out, guys. You might want to watch a better demonstration because I did not do the greatest. But as you can see, it's pretty fun. I'm going to be up all night playing with this thing. So if you guys like this video, remember to hit the thumbs up button. Um, subscribe right up there. Follow me on Twitter, Fishy15. 
If you want, you can check out my other videos, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.